Hi folks, I will try to be as quick as possible on uh, workpiece and tool offsets on these older Okuma machines. Machine I have here is uh, MC4VA with the OSP 5000 MG system. So I have already prepared in the manual mode these things. So on this machine wise there is located this Teflon workpiece. The new num tool will be this uh, drill bit. And uh, here we can see the very crude slip gouge block. In this case, this uh, steel workpiece is 100 by 100 millimeters in dimensions. So I can slip it under the tool. So this is done for initial setup of the tool tip height. Next thing to do is uh, changing this workpiece offset number. For this we move to MDI screen and uh, with the help of data input now I press G15 and the new workpiece offset number will be under H2. Then press the right button and for machine to accept it you should press the cycle start. Cycle start so the coordinate is changed to number 2. Next move to this zero set screen. Now we are under the zero set and uh, with this red asterisk we see that the active is workpiece number 2. So here we can set the program zeros for x, y and in our case the z is we are working now. So then there is this magic button calibration. We press the calibration so we see that the cursor waits for entering the number. We already know that the tool tip is at the height of 100 millimeters so we enter the 100 millimeters press right and now we can see that the actual position of workpiece for Z is changed to 100 millimeters so for X and Y you can set the same so it depends on where the program start point for X and Y where the zeros is located okay for that now let's move again to the MDI mode so this drill bit so here on this LED display we can see that the active step so the tool in the spindle nose is under number of 12 so what I like to do is uh, setting the tool number and the uh, tool length offset numbers the same. So this means T12, H12. So now press the data input G54, H12. Again, write and for machine to accept it it's now at the zero press the cycle start cycle start so it's under the height offset of 12 next move to this tool data screen red asterisk shows that uh, the active is tool number 12 so with the cursor buttons move to tool number 12 or other number that you have there magic button calibration calibration then press right so the tool height now is set under 100 millimeters and the next thing to do is to 
offset this cutter radius compensation or diameter so it's already set at the needed diameter which is six millimeters so now MDI we see that the tool is at the height of 100 millimeters tool offset length offset is 12 and uh, if we need to choose this diameter remember to correctly set these length offsets and diameters in your program otherwise you can uh, crash your tool and uh, broke your work pieces data input G54 H12 diameter 12 right and cycle start so these are changed to needed numbers so these older controls is made in that way if I press this manual mode it drops to zero so be careful with that so I hope this can help to set your tools in your machine